Since the beginning of time, men have found different venues to stay connected and informed, from smoke signals, stone scripts, pictographs, ballads, etc. But the necessity to create new innovative venues to facilitate communication with others increased. In 1439, the printer press came to life, and the era of newspapers began. At first, as new pamphlets or broadsides. And finally, in 1666, the first newspaper came out, the London Gazette. It was not until 1800 that new technology was born. This technology was the beginning of the Industrial Revolution. Inventions like the string printer machine, the telegraph, the telephone, and the radio came to life, creating a new era of communication and information. The need to maintain the public well informed created a demand for professional journalists for newspaper and radio broadcasting. Later, with the invention of television in the late 1920s and then commercially available in the late 1930s, a new age of television broadcasting was introduced. The public was informed through newspapers, radio and television, but as technology evolved, another venue of communication commenced public networks like NPR and PBS, commercial networks like CNN and ABC, news 24-7, news and more news, a demand for more professional journalists. But with new technology, the way that journalism was known changed, and it continues changing. A necessity of always being connected created new venues, blogs, palms, text messaging, and social networks. And with this, a new question begins. Are we all journalists?